Get some rest, but I'm up and at them today. I got a work day today, so I got up around seven and I'm going to go get a coffee from my favorite local shop and then I'm gonna head to um, my mom's house to get some work done, but that's where all the gift bar stuff is that I'm working on while I'm here. So I am gonna head over there and work from the little office there and then get some gift bar stuff done. It was a long travel day, but we made it, got some sleep, we're home, feeling refreshed, and I don't feel that tired, which is so weird. I keep waiting to like not feel good or have a headache or be exhausted, and I really am feeling fine, so. Not bad, I did bring in vitamin C with me. We'll take that, I gotta get some electrolytes in today. Excited to be here. It was snow on the forecast yesterday, but today it's a little warmer. I think it's like 40 degrees. LOL. But I'm really not doing much while I'm here. I'm here to work on gift bar and yeah, just get a lot of that stuff done. So that'll be my main focus and then just hanging out with my family. I'm so sad oh, that my brother's not going to be here. He literally left yesterday. Worst timing. But his wife is here. My sister's here. My dad's here. My mom will be home on Sunday. So, I plan to just be relaxing and going to all my favorite spots. Dame gets here on Thursday, but I figured I would kick off the vlog since we're here. Might as well. And it might be kind of boring, but whatever. What are you doing? Good morning. Here? Hi. Hi Cutie pie. Do I look tan? Yeah. I put on tanner literally last yeah. night. It, let's do a iced something with a little fun flavor, not so sweet. Let's do almond milk. Almond? Mm. Okay, coffee secured. I am so mad I forgot the car tripod. I honestly, not that I had room, if I did remember. A little avo toast. Coffee is so good. I just, I like that I can go and not micromanage the order and be like, make me something good. Because like I'm a psycho when I am ordering from other places and have to be so specific because they just don't get it. But there I can just be like, you know what I like, make it good. And they crush it every time. Oh yeah, I just went back home and um, went back home and hopped on my computer and just worked from there for a little while. Had my avocado toast from Edge, had my coffee, did some work, and then I left again and went to South, which is like a local restaurant and coffee house um, close to us. So I went and worked there for the rest of the day. Got a lot of work done. It was actually really productive, which was so nice. Um, it's really busy when I went, but it was good. I got a coffee and a veggie burrito, delish. And then I just got a little decaf one to go from there and I finally made it to my mom's house. I'm working from the gift bar office today. That is just so stunning. I'll show you guys. This is our gifting business office. Oh, it's getting a little dark now. But we have all the products lined on the shelves up here. Our boxes stacked there. Some boxes that we need to unbox and put on the shelves. Um, some of our Mother's Day boxes, so cute. <gasps> our 
our lighting for photos, our cute little drawers from Ikea over here that we keep like ribbon, tape, scissors, cards, all that stuff. More Mother's Day styled boxes and this is kind of where we'll write the note cards, tile the ribbon up, all that stuff. Cute. Hey. Also, I'm obsessing over this sweater. I need another set. They had like a yellow and a pink one. Or is it red? I don't know. But um, that'll go more neutral because I know I'll wear this all the time and I feel like it's gonna be literally worn out by the time it's even winter. But I love it. It's not really short sweater here, so I'm just wearing it with my leggings. But this is from my Daily's Drills package that I just, I think I unboxed it in the last vlog. I don't know, I also have a TikTok going up about it too though. So anyways, I just got here with my decaf coffee. I'm gonna sit down at this little table and work away on some stuff but my regular work day is all wrapped up had a veggie burrito for lunch and yeah i'm gonna get some work done and then i think maybe stop by the store see what groceries i can get for dinner see what my dad and my sister are up to for din maybe make some i saw he had fish in the freezer so probably make some of that but just chilling and relaxing doing nothing um yeah except for hanging at home so Pilates class and I'm gonna go do that upstairs really quick. I'm just gonna do a 20 minute sweat with TPC and get my body moving a little bit so that I can run to the grocery store, pick up some stuff for dinner and then go home and make dinner and then shower and go to bed. Ready to get back on the grind and also to get back to cooking and having really good healthy meals. So the plate, yeah, the weekend was just a lot of eating out. Travel days are always a lot of eating out. Um, yeah, so we'll start with a good, healthy dinner tonight. I'm really excited. I love this brand of hummus, but I saw this and had to get it. It was, you know, $8, but the flavor sounded so good. And I know Dame would never eat it, so getting it while we're here. But $75. Found my trusty Olipop. Also really excited to try this coconut jasmine rice. Yum. Um, yeah, okay. We got the goods out. Gonna get the cod out. Miso glazed cod. We can do a shrimp bowl another night. But I think we just throw this in the oven. I'm gonna do the couscous and then some veggies in a little teriyaki sauce. Yoshida's the OG. So oh, good. They look so good. Lars is gonna taste test the hummus for me. Okay, what cracker do you want? Oh, we got a little These. Some items in there. Or. There it's was, a plain one. I definitely did eat all the plain ones the other day. These are garden veggie. Yeah, try that. They kind of have a lot of flavor, but they're pretty good. Really? Yeah. We'll bring these too. Did Which I not buy nice? crackers? Or I just buy siete. Yeah. yeah, I just bought siete. Oh, okay. Mmm, wow. look at that. My beans a little. <laughs> it's crazy. Nice. Let's get the smell test. We need a tripod in here. Oh, that smells like pickles. Is it? Yeah. That smells good. Let me mm. smell. Very pickly. Whoa. Is it just pickle hummus? Yeah, it's the grill yeah. pickle hummus. Yeah. Okay. Bite. Give it a whirl. Cracker. Just a little. Mm 
It tastes like just pickles. Really? Mm -hmm. <gasps> like it just tastes like I put a pickle on top of this cracker. Yeah. Okay, I'm trying garden veggie cracker. It doesn't even taste like hummus. Solid. Oh, it's so weird. It's weird. It's like you're eating creamy pickles. <laughs> it's weird. <laughs> it was pretty good. I like it with these. Literally, she's like you're eating like ground up pickles. Yes. Oh, it's good though. It doesn't taste like hummus. Jay Green would dilly. Get vomit. Really? He would vomit. Is it not like pickles? No. What? No. You know what my favorite is? No bread pickles, and butter. no olives. You got good bread and butter pickles. What if you dipped a pickle in the pickle hummus? Oh my god. Double pickage. Have you tried dill pickle lace? No. Mm mm. I didn't even know they had those. So good. That sounds like one of those flavors they would only have in Canada. Mm hmm. Like the ketchup. I think they're good. Really? I like this brand. Mm hmm. I'm pretty sure it's clean. Probably. Looks like it. Look at the little guy. <laughs> Chickpeas, Grillo's pickles, water, tahini, vinegar. Oh. Sunflower oil. Not good. First ingredients are. What do you do? Peas and pickles. Yum. That's pretty accurate. Yum. Delish. Oh, I've got. It's really good. It's strong. Like, I don't think I can have too much of that. Would you rather have this or regular hummus? Mm, probably this. Or garlic hummus. <laughs> Costco. We put it in the oven. Veggies and edamame. Some garlic couscous. And we're doing green onion, avocado, arugula. Oh, we need everything bagel seasoning. Gorge. Honestly, <laughs> that's impressive. <laughs> Dang. <laughs> so good. Dinner. My hair has been so crazy today. <laughs> Oh my god, also, put tanning drops on. Can't tell if I'm orange or I look like a good glow. It's giving a little orange. Anyways, I am upstairs and about to get ready for bed. It's so late. It's, we just like cleaned up dishes and it's 9.45. Very late dinner, but it was so good. The miso cod from Costco was amazing. So had that with some teriyaki veggies and the couscous. Delish. And it's so light out. I can't I think that's why I'm like so tripped out. It's almost 10 o'clock and it's bright as ever out. This is like literally natural sunlight. This is where I'm staying. Look how cute this headboard is. My dad just put it back up. But yeah, no curtains um, in this entire house. <laughs> Which I don't mind. I just wear an eye mask to sleep. Um, and I can also just kind of sleep in the light anyways, but... It really plays tricks on your mind. I have a 7 a.m. meeting, 7 a.m. my time here, so not bad. I'll probably get up and start working at 6, have a meeting at 7, um, and then probably go on a little walk tomorrow. But yeah, it's a great little chill day. I'm going to get ready for bed, put my pajamas on, brush my teeth, wash my face, lay down, um, check out the rest of my day for tomorrow other than my meeting, see what I got to do. And then hit the heck.
strap and there's just not a spot to like be quiet in the house. There's plenty of places to take the zoom, but not to like be quiet and not wake anyone up. So here we are in the bathroom. <laughs> Anyways, caught up, made some coffee, took my meeting, and now I'm gonna go back downstairs, get some more coffee, have a little egg or two, and then get to work. I'm gonna hang out here for the first part of the morning and then go over to the gift bar office for the afternoon. Nothing really planned today, so just gonna be hanging out and relaxing at home. A little walk. We got Miss Phoebe's with us here. We got a coffee. Also using this caramel macchiato creamer. What are you doing, Bruno? Also, this path is where I'm like terrified of moose and bears. So, heads on a little bit of a swivel. Phoebe freaks me out too. She'll be like, I don't know, she sends me into a panic. Anyways, getting some fresh air. It feels so good. Other than the fact that my hands are freezing off. I wish I had gloves or mittens or something, but the fresh air feels so nice. We're getting a little steps in. I'm gonna try to do this every day while I'm here as long as the weather's all right. I think the weather actually gets a lot better um, this week. So I think today is a little chilly, a little rainy, but after that, we got a little sun in the forecast. So. Hello. Hi. Um, what can I get for you? Um, can I do an iced Americano? So See you guys. Later. Bye. Iced Americano. So good. Okay, this road. Stop by Edge again for a little afternoon iced coffee. I forgot that Lars, I got that cold brew for Lars yesterday and I could've made one at home, but Edge is so good, so I'm not mad about it. I got the date night syrup and I kinda forget what's in it. I think it's pistachio maybe, but it's really good. Gonna go get some more work done, film in the gift bar office. The lighting is actually really good at the moment um that front office gets so much natural light so it's the best for taking pictures because once it gets dark it's dark and say hi to the vlog what's up fam <laughs> did you pack your toiletries yet be on the pn tomorrow uh no i haven't i gotta use them right now at the shower are you gonna uber tomorrow it's 5.30 a.m. Not as bad as my 4.30 a.m. No, 5.30 is actually not bad at all. No, it really isn't. What are you going to get no. to eat at the airport? Checking in. Just got back to my dad's house and I'm going to make some food. It's really late. I had a really not productive day. Honestly, I just, <sighs> I had those like tasks to do where you can't just like do the task and get it over with. You have to like really think and like, I don't know, kind of go back and forth and figure it out. It's not just like a boom, boom, boom task to complete. So it just took a while and you really gotta like be in the right headspace. I don't know, just one of those days. But just got back here. Hockey is on the TV. We're watching Oilers in the Night. And I am going to make some dinner for myself. My dad can't eat because he has a um, doctor's appointment tomorrow. So, oh, what is that? Mm, a little sandwich. He has a doctor's appointment tomorrow, so he's not eating. So my sister's camping. I am here by myself and going to make my own dinner. I'm gonna have this pickle hummus again because that is so good. So good. 
I also have some leftover couscous and veggies from yesterday, so I probably have some of that. It's been very chill. It's kind of nice not having everyone here quite yet because I can literally just stay at home and do nothing. And I love that for me. What else? Oh, I got an Olipop yesterday. I have that. <laughs> you can only drink Gatorade and chicken broth. <laughs> Poor guy. got my water whatever good morning I have not vlogged yet this morning I have been taking meetings working away I just dropped my dad at the doctor um, I was so tired last night I was like I couldn't think straight I, my brain was not working I could barely keep my eyes open so I literally had dinner went upstairs finished editing and passed right out so I actually feel really good today. I got such good sleep and got up, took a meeting, did a little bit of work, and then I got ready, took a quick body shower and threw on this Lonely Ghost hoodie that I'm obsessed with, still straight out of Larson's closet. We love her. Um, and yeah, took my dad to the doctor. I have one more meeting today and is in 30 minutes. So I'm gonna run over to a coffee shop. It's called Black Cup. And it's actually pretty cute. Um, I don't remember, I think they have Kaladi coffee. So I think the coffee is pretty good, but I honestly don't remember. Um, but I'm gonna go take a meeting from there. Hopefully it's not too crazy and loud. It's 10.30 right now. Ooh. Dame gets here tonight at 11. And then picking him up so late. I, last night as I was falling asleep, I was like, oh my God, tomorrow I have to stay up until 11, 11.30. <sighs> and not go to bed until like midnight, 12.30. Yikes. Thank you. I just, I thought I- Dad's ready for pickup. Black Cup was nice and they had a really good coffee. I got an almond, sorry, that air is probably so loud. But I got an almond milk cappuccino and took my um, meeting, had a meeting with TikTok and it went really well. I like, I always like chatting with them because I always learn so much and they're always rolling out new stuff. So it's good to hear from them about that. But did that and got some work done from the cafe. Picking my dad up now, he's ready to roll and then we'll probably get him some food. you guys I just had to share this is the comfiest I don't eat that's just such an understatement I don't even know what to say there's nothing like this couch I've never sat on a couch that even close to compares there is nothing more comfortable you sink in and I could literally I would rather sleep here than my own bed I've been sitting here um, on my laptop I am doing some Instagram stories doing a little design on Canva um yeah also god bless canva like i learned illustrator and photoshop and stuff in school and then like i didn't get a job immediately after that needed that so i lost all of those skills and i yeah wish i did it but thank god for canva like it's the reason that i can do very very light um graphic design and get 
so much done that I wouldn't be able to do pre Canva. I wish we had this in college, honestly, just for presentations and stuff. Um, I love it. I've also been doing mock-ups of our living room. <laughs> Oh, it's like testing different poof colors and stuff. My poof actually got to Anchorage to, to Anchorage. My poof arrived at the house in Austin today. Um, I think I'm going to have our friend go put it inside for us. But I'm really excited. Hoping it looks cute. Is it rude to ask him to unpack it and put it in the living room and send me a picture? I would literally never do that, but that's like my dream. For doing design work like this, that you really have to get in the zone and just like sit and stare at your computer. I love to have like an Olipop, a glass of wine, something like a good drink. Like water just doesn't cut it for this kind of stuff. Or like a good coffee obviously during the day, but it is 7 p.m. So well, I'm wanting to open the wine, but I think I'm going to get a workout in first. So I think I'm going to take a break from this, go upstairs, do some Pilates, and then crack open the wine. Haven't really done much all day, but hanging in the house again, like I said, it's been very, not boring, just like really relaxing and slow paced and I love it so much. Um, I have to stay up pretty late to get Dame, but that's okay. I'll just be hanging out all night until he gets here. Then tomorrow, one more work day and then we're hanging this weekend. I'm actually really excited to be both of us off work and just chilling in Anchorage. So probably gonna moose this tooth tomorrow. Gonna go see our friends on Saturday, really excited. And yeah, that's about it. This workout in. I use the Pilates class app and I do it on my phone or on my laptop, but I pay a subscription for it every month. And this is what it looks like. You can see, but they come out with, um, I don't know if you see that literally at all, but she comes out with new classes, like I think weekly, if not more than that. And yeah, I just like to try a bunch of different ones. They often do like a challenge or something that gives you a little bit more of a schedule, which I like because then I don't have to sit here and like figure out what class I want to try. It just is like laid out for you. And I'm like, this is what I'm doing this week. No questions about it. I don't know what I'm picking today. Let's see what we got. I tried a new one yesterday. Booty burn nine. I love a full body. I love like a classic Pilates class. There's also a new guy instructor on here, which would be fun to try. Pilates body. I really like power Pilates is usually a good one. I don't know. I wish I always like heart some. I wish I had more hearted. I'm not very good at remembering to do that. But she sorts them by like prenatal, recovery, calm, stretch, bar, sweat, energy boost, morning classes. She actually has some reformer classes on here too if you like had a reformer at home. I think I might do a full body four. It says it's level intense and I've hearted it before. So let's try that one. Look how much snow is on these mountains. So wild. Oh my gosh. It's literally May. It's like the middle of May. Hi. Got the hockey game on. You make some tacos with me? Come on. Making tacos. Black beans, all the peppers, veggie. Gonna do some zucchini, mushroom, rice.
got some ground beef, Spanish rice. Yum. We don't have sour cream, but that's okay. I just put this as like my sour cream substitution for a sauce. Excited. It's delish. Got the wine, but oh my god, she's pulling like no other. Got the wine, got the dog. I'm gonna head out for a little night walk. It is like almost 10 o'clock, you guys, and this is how light it is. It's so insane. The sunset. I wish you guys could see it. It is not my first moose. Not my first moose. My first moose on this trip. I'm on my way to get Dave from the airport. It's so late. It's like 11.30. But I had to come on and share my little moose spotting. Chilling on C Street. So tired. I went on a fun little walk with Miss Beebs. I walked a little longer than I was planning to, but it was really nice. Made it home. Taking my vitamins. So happy Dave's here. I think I'm gonna take a nap tomorrow. I'm already planning on it. Dave will probably be up at five. I'll probably be up at six for my meeting. And then have a little work day, take a nap, and then hopefully go get some good dinner somewhere. That's about it. But I figured I would end the vlog here for this one for these few days. And then kick off a new one with Mr. Anyways, we'll see you guys in the next one that we're kicking off tomorrow. Yeah. Yeah. Alaska vlogs. See you soon. <laughs> <laughs> Bye. Do if we had it all wrong, got what we want, but we still want more, you know. What would you do? Yeah.